Hi, this is Francisco Bridgian from vitalcoaching.com and we are talking about fitness, diets and vitality. The topic for now is how to eat more fruit. I guess if you have been listening to these uh, videos already and uh, other MP3 audios, you know already that having healthy snacks is really a big part of uh, being and staying healthy and uh, especially on being fit. If you want, for instance, to lose weight, if you want to get back in shape, eating more fruit is really one essential strategy. Now when you want to eat more fruit, most of the times, if you just want, uh, you know, you want a snack, um, well, grabbing just a full apple, for instance, or a, a whole banana, sometimes it's just too much. <laughs> you simply have, uh, you know, you want to have a snack, but simply having a whole fruit is very, um, you know, it can, be, it can be too much. And uh, you see this uh, piece of fruit sitting there, uh, this whole apple or, or, uh, or banana or more melon, um, you know, and you think, well, this, uh, I, I have, a, I'm a little bit hungry, but I am, um, you know, eating a whole, a whole fruit is too much. So what I want to check with you is a couple of very simple strategies that you can apply simply to increase your level, uh, uh, how much fruit you, you take, you take in. And the first thing, which is very, very simple, we are going to go and take a little tour here around the kitchen is to, um, Okay, here we go. Take a knife. And uh, you take your, your banana and you cut it in half. That's it. It's as simple as that. You see that now, once you have half a banana, well, this is something that you can afford in terms of, uh, of eating. The next thing, apple, same story, right? Okay, here we go. Eating half an apple is very easy. It's much, much easier than having a full apple. Uh, that's the first strategy. You don't, have, you don't need to eat a full uh, banana or apple or any other fruit. You can eat parts of it. And uh, once you eat this one, the other half stays there for later, right? I mean, this is common sense. But um, the thing is that when you, when you are trying to, to eat more food, most of the times you will find this challenging because of that. The second strategy is to, pe to, to take uh, all sorts of pieces of fruit, you put them into here a, a little um, you know jar, and uh, you use your uh, mixer, and uh, here we go. You make a very nice uh, shake out of that. And uh, for instance, in the last one that I prepared here, uh, there was um, uh, you know two bananas, uh, three apples, two oranges, and this gives you a very nice smoothie. Here we go. See, this is a very nice. Uh, juice is still a little bit solid. If you want to make it a little bit more liquid, you can, uh, you know, you can uh, add a little bit more water. Now, if you want to take this, for instance, as a snack, you can easily take it to work. You put it into, um, into, uh, you know, half a liter bottle, something with, uh, you know, with a large. Uh, and uh, you know opening and um, and then here we go you can take your shake to to work which is going to give you a very good snack a very very um yeah very powerful one now i tried other methods for instance um we have here um you know um, a juicer and uh, the juicer is creates really these nice juices but the the problem is really the waste uh, that you have with the juices because two thirds of the fruit or two thirds of the vegetable that you are uh, juicing is a, it's actually going to be wasted. So you you have lots of waste in terms of fiber and uh, it of course makes uh, the, your juice much more expensive. So to uh, to summarize here, uh, the best is really to use um, to first have the idea of cutting the pieces, <laughs> cutting uh, you know the fruit in in halves, which uh, which makes it uh, affordable actually to eat. And uh, then the second thing is to use a, a mixer and uh, then to pour all that within a, a little bottle and take it, uh, you know, take it, take it wherever you go. If you are in nature or if you go to, to work, um, that's what you can have for lunch, for instance, or for, for a little snack in the afternoon. Okay, so this is a very, very simple tip that you can start applying uh, straight away. Uh, the good news with that is that fruit, you can almost eat as much as you want. You will never get, uh, gain weight because of that. If you think that the banana is going to make you fat, forget about it. It's not true. This is a myth, <laughs> right? 
um, that's the first thing to realize. It is that fruit, you can eat as much as you want. If it will give you uh, the, the fruit sugar that you need, if you are craving a little bit for sugar, for something sweet, you can really use fruit, um, you know, to, uh, to, to gain uh, whatever sweet, sweet you need. Uh, and again, the, the very excellent news is that you can eat as much fruit as you want and you won't gain weight, really. It's uh, because, because the amount of calories that you have literally in, in fruit is, is relatively small, you can keep on eating and you will feel very quickly full. On top of that, it will give you lots of vitamins and lots of uh, nutrients that you, that you really need. Okay, um, I hope this makes sense. I'll be back very soon with more tips uh, on how to stay fit on the long term. Take care for now and bye-bye.